Hello, welcome back everyone to another episode of The Binding of Isaac. If that's one thing I've learned over the last few episodes, it's that sometimes you just have to stop recording for a day, just call the day and uh, come back a different day because yeah, it'll just end up making you uh, too annoyed to even play properly if you keep going. So this time we're going with an Ebron, obviously, as uh, you can see. Why are we going with Eve? Well, because I got tired of playing as Madeline. Uh, we get a Curse of the Darkness from the very get-go, which means we can't see a bloody thing, but hey, it's fine. It's the first floor. We've dealt with this before and it should be no problem. Wow, that's a good amount of money from a single chest. Uh, and my neighbors, uh, or my upstairs neighbors. Is it called upstairs neighbors? Uh, whatever. A noisy again. I don't think you can hear it though, which is good, because that just means that it's just annoying me and not you guys. Which is perfectly fine with me. So, what do we get? We get Jouop de Wub, which is, uh... Well, it's a, it's a space buy item. <laughs> that mod is for certain. It's not a great space buy item, unfortunately. But it's a space buy item, nonetheless. So, we'll, uh... Whoa, okay. Just go by doing that. Wow, okay. That actually took out a lot of its health right from the get-go, so that's good. And let's uh, be smart about this. Ah, I said be smart about it. Okay, my neighbor is really, really freaking noisy, which is what's distracting me here. Sorry about that. Ah, it wouldn't be so problematic if this apartment wasn't so... Uh, uh, what is that even called in, in, in English? Where whatever goes on upstairs and downstairs is easily hurt. I don't know. So we're going to the curse room because I need to focus on the game and that turned out to not be worth anything. Thankfully, damage on this floor will make no difference whatsoever as far as goes for achievements as well as uh, general gameplay because no deals with the devil and uh, I guess we might as well pick up the range upgrade. So, what's the deal with Eve? She is weak. She is decently fast, but she is weak. And that is what we have to uh, work to at solving when playing as her. And hopefully... Ugh. Ugh. Okay. So these, this item I will avoid, because that gives me uh, shots that, that boomerang back to me. And if there's one thing I remember, that is that I do not like that item, or that uh, tears effect. And if there's another thing I learned recently, it is if I know that I don't like a tears effect, I should not pick it up. Just look at uh, chocolate milk, for instance, which... That's... Oh, so great memories, huh? It's like it happened just a few runs ago. Oh, wow, okay, that's actually not a bad space buy item. I might go for that uh, tinted rock, but we... Rock, but we have a low amount of bombs, so I will... Uh, have to wait and see what lies ahead. Did we get another Curse of Darkness? That's interesting. I didn't even notice until now. Just goes to show how little I've needed the, the map of this floor. So we're going for the... Can I get a reroll on this thing? That would be really lovely. Because I would really like to have this at uh, the boss battle. So let's see. We came from over here. <clears throat> Did we go up here? Did we come from up here? No, we didn't. We didn't go here, that is. Oh wait, how oh, and we didn't come from up here, so... I was correct in both my... Ah, uh... Uh, wow, okay, I almost ran right into that. That would have been fun. Okay, this is a bit too risky. Okay, let's not take damage at the boss battle and we should be just fine. Okay, I have a key, but that's a bit... Uh... Yeah, I don't like the idea of that. That was a waste of a bomb. Actually, the chances of us getting a key at the next floor are pretty decent. A speed upgrade, I guess. That's alright. It's not great, but at least it helps me become faster, which is usually something I don't mind. I guess you can get too you can get too fast, but hey, in this case, not so bad. This boss fight should be easily over with. Ah, that's half health. And since it's already a weak Weak boss. I expect this to be over really, really fast. Okay, so just stay up here and we should be fairly safe from harm from the flies, to some extent. 
has some uh, room to fail, but in general, the flies seem to avoid going too high. Which is good, because that means uh, I don't have to worry too much. And if Dookie would just not come so close, that would have been lovely. But hey, we have... Ah, uh, yeah, we're probably not getting a deal with... Oh! We did get a deal with the devil. So that's the ability to fly, which will lower our health to really, really low health. I don't like that idea. So once again, I will skip a deal with the devil. You would think that I would soon stop doing that, but with our current health, I don't like it. Maybe I should gamble a bit more, though, because if you look at the last few runs where I did not take deals with the devil, we have lost a lot of those. Which could be a testament to the fact that you should gamble more with your health, with your life, but I don't know. I just. I have a sense of prediction in mind that goes that we would have died soon ish if I picked anything up from that. Mainly because, um, well, Demon Baby, not worth my time or my health. And uh, ability to fly, kinda two hearts. That's, we would be down at. What is that? Who has that much health? Is that that's not Samson? It's Samson? I don't remember if Samson or Judas, but one of them. And I remember those two being not too fun to play as, so... Wow, okay, that took longer to extra shoot than I expected, so that sucks. Well, we already lost health, so why not? Oh, we got some health back. And that's good. Got some health back, and finally we're not on the dark Curse of Darkness floor, so we can actually see where we're going. That's actually pretty good. Okay, don't like this. I should get out of that small spot at the very least. Um, I dodged something that didn't need dodging. That's the problem about these guys. You think you know what they're going to do, and then... Then they just decide to not do what you think. That bird totally helped me out there. Now I could use a key so I can go to my item room, and this is where I should probably have... Given second thoughts to that golden chest at the last floor. But hey, sometimes... It pays out, sometimes it doesn't. This time, it sort of paid out, but not great. Okay, this room is just, ugh, so annoying. And the fact that they had to free that near to fly, even more annoying. Okay, dude, stay away. I'm not that far away, I want to be able to hit you. Dude. Okay, there we go, and that's the key. And the boss room as well, hmm. We might still have a chance of another deal with the devil or angel, depending on... <laughs> Telepathy for dummies. I guess that was a waste of a key, yeah? Pick it up. Put it down. Let's never see that again in this run. Never again in this run. That's kind of contradicting itself, but okay. Who are we going up against? Fallen? Oh dear goodness, that's... Uh... Ouch, a problem. So we took damage of this boss fight, which means that we're not getting a deal with the devil most likely. Oh well, it depends on if it's red hot damage accounts only. So Dead bird is really helping out here, which is surprising and good. Good in a su surprising in a good way. Surprising in a good way, I guess you could also say. Ah, totally didn't do anything. Should have placed it just a tiny bit earlier. Okay, that's should. Ah, I don't have any more bombs. That's a problem. Okay. Now I wish I had the battery so that my uh, swoop the whoop could uh, rich shots during battle. That would have been lovely. Okay, that other guy is almost dead. If you would stop chasing me, please, sir. Oh god, is he just going to keep charging at me like that for the rest of this fight? Ouch, you got me, stop it. That's for some reason I keep getting stuck in that freaking wall over there. Okay, so this is one of the boss fights where we really have problems with. Uh, Oh, stop it. Eve's low damage. I think we might die here. I mean, we have a decent amount of health, but just the sheer amount of time it takes to finish this fight. That's just ridiculous. Oh, and I got stuck in a freaking wall. That is seriously a glitch I hope they fix in in the Rip Earth, because that is just so BS. And that guy... Ah, oh, I wish I had placed that bomb properly at the start. That would have taken out a lot of their health. Fortunately... I was too slow. The good thing about them charging me is I'm decently, decently fast, which means that I, as long as they don't suddenly stop, like that, it's actually not a bad thing that they're charging me. Okay, so we get... Hmm. Is that a good item? Oh, it's technology. 
Uh, I guess it's an alright item. Can I get out of here without... Yes, I can. Okay. Technology. Hmm. Why do I have a bad memory? I have a bad feeling I have some non not so good memories with this item. It should be a decent item, though. Oh, yeah. That's right. We are freaking weak. I don't think that's... A f I don't think we've gotten weaker by picking up technology, though. I don't think so, at least. Okay, so if we have half a heart more, we can go to that challenge room. Which would more than likely benefit us no matter what happens. Uh, I would actually like money more. We don't even have... Mm, we have nothing. So I guess that was all I got for that. Okay. So we got a health upgrade. And technology. Still not sure how I feel about technology. I should probably be happy. I'm not sure though. Part of me is just kind of eh, unsure about it. I think the secret room was right there. I'm unsure about a lot of things all of a sudden. Oh yeah, this item doesn't uh, have, have shots through rocks and other obstacles. I am one-shotting flies though now. Ah, uh, never mind. Seems to be one-shotting them. Some of them. Two-shotting others. Maybe it's just two-shotting and I just was lucky with the other ones. Okay. Whoa, not so close, dude. Okay. This is kind of sad, but I kind of miss having fly off. Okay. That room is over. Could really, really use some damage upgrades. Because we are so freaking weak. I'd forgotten how terrible it is to be... Ah, there we go. Eve. So. At least Swoop the Whoop is decent... Um, Space behind him for a change, which is surprising because Swoop the Whoop is never really worth picking up. But I guess when you don't really have anything else, it suddenly becomes a good item. So, um, that's one of the worst boss drops we can get. So this sucks. Hopefully, I won't get hit. But uh, from what I recall, chat speeds up the more damage it takes. So there's a decent chance that we will actually take damage here. The good thing. Yep, no, no deal with the Devil Force. Good thing about Chad is that technology deals extra damage to him because of the fact that he has uh, several... Uh, uh, what is it called? Parts to his body? And I deal dam damage to each of them because of the piercing shots, so that's great. Okay. I don't know, I just seem to keep getting stuck in the freaking wall. It seems so at least, but maybe it's just... I don't know. Go in here, hope for... Hmm, copy's hairball. It's kind of a familiar-ish type of item. I really don't know how to use it effectively, though. It's kind of a slingshot item. You have to go forward, slingshot it into enemies, hope for its damage. I don't know how much damage is even. Hmm. Okay, this is an easy room, thankfully. I say and run straight into a shot that uh, that was pretty damn stupid of me. Just as stupid as this guy. There we go, get a bomb, blow that up. Perfect, got two bombs back and I think... Maybe? Nope, okay. So now we're back to square one with bombs. But hey, we got a soul heart from that. Which is good because I need that. Okay, play it safe. Played safe. Okay, more pumps. And here's an arcade. Okay, this becomes very interesting all of a sudden. Um, I need more hearts though. My experience in arcades with Eve though is that we lose a lot. That's something I do not like. Huh, pill. Well, speed down. Okay, doesn't hurt. We have a decent speed already and that's a lot of keys. Okay. Hmm, okay. He wants me to keep going, thank you. Another pill. Why do we suddenly have such... <laughs> Lockdown, okay. Ah, there's bombs. That's not really what I wanted. I want health upgrades. Oh, not upgrades. Uh, health. Health. Just health. I want health. Oh, money. And look at look here, he's not gonna pay out. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Damn bastard. Hmm. So I camped the way out of all our money, which means that... Okay, that's a library. What the hell? Okay, we're really freaking weak. 
like really, really freaking weak. That was mostly out of, of uh, laziness that I did that. Uh, I don't know why I wasted the key to go in here. We don't have any money. I should go to the library instead. I don't know what I was doing. Okay, so here's the Book of Belial. And Monster Manual. I think having Book of Belial increases our chance of a deal with the devil. And it's a good damage upgrade. Is it better than Swoop the Whoop? I believe so, but I am actually not sure. We will try this. If nothing else, I would call this an experimental run. It's not good enough to really win anything anyway, so might as well. I'm uh, going low here. I know it's risky. Probably a bad idea even. I thought I should check if there is a... There should be some sort of challenge room. With some luck it might be a boss challenge room and I have not done this for naught. With some lag of luck there will be no, no challenge room at all. I will test this out. How is our damage now? Well, it's better. It's not great, but it's better. Eh, still takes three shots for that. Yeah. I'm not predicting the bestest of uh, future for us at this point. So, one bomb for two bombs and a chance to maybe find the secret room. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm game. Yeah, not a secret room, but we did get a new bomb. A new bomb? An extra bomb. So it's not there, it's not there. Well, there's, a, there's still a few places where the secret room could be, potentially. Should probably dodge upwards since the shots of these seem to be going slightly downwards. I think. That might also just be me. Uh, I think the shots go slightly downwards. So, it could be here, and I get a chest and a turret cord. Cord? Card? Yeah, that was worth it. The world. I will probably use that at a later point. Ah, a bit more money, that's really useful actually. Could help us in the arcade. Given that, oh, if we get two more cents, I might. Ah. Our pill rotation seems really bad, so I'm probably not buy mom's coin purse. Just seems like a bad deal, a really bad deal to be honest. Um, hmm. Where would I be if I was a secondary secret room? I'm thinking here. Oh, actually, that room all the way out here is a, it's a really good bet. So maybe... Well, this will probably not work on that rock, will it? But we did get the secondary secret room, which is absolutely perfect health-wise. So that gives us a decent chance. It costs us another bomb. But we get some good gambling chances on the uh, blood bank. It's a bit of backtracking as well, but we're decently fast that I am willing to go a bit back and forth for that. If it can improve our chances, it is worth it. <laughs> of course, health is not the most sore spot we have, but... Uh, and we might end up getting the ivy back instead. Depending on how a lock is. Okay, so uh, still haven't paid out. I will go back, but first and foremost, I will gamble a bit. With any lock we might get... Uh, what is that? We don't know. Bombs are key. I'm not too sure how I feel about that, actually. Not too sure. Okay, if you're going, if you're going to pay out, do it now. That's not paying out. Ah, health. Only a small bit, but it's health. And that's not health. <laughs> yeah, that's the chance of a key. By now I would more so want a bomb, though. Well, I guess more keys doesn't hurt, though. Another pill? This slot machine is... Interesting. I'll say that much. I don't think Tears Up does much for our... Uh... Oh, it does actually. Oh! Okay, well that gave us some bombs, so that's fine. Let's go back and grab some more health. Yeah, let's go back and grab some more health. And uh, then gamble a bit more and then we'll head back down into... Oh, back down, we'll go further into... To the game. Since that's how we play it, obviously. Da -da -da -da. Grab that, that, and that. Technically, we could come get, come back one more time. I think I will do that. Seems like a fair enough, good enough deal for me. Book of Belial is. Mm, yeah, I think Book of. Nah, uh, maybe. I really can't tell if Book of Belial or. Um, Swoop the Whoop is the better choice here. 
Okay. I'm not so happy about how this is going, I must admit. It's a bit more risky than I would like, but we're damn sure getting a lot of keys. Okay, payout. Ah, yeah, I did. Okay. That solves our fly problems. Now go back, get the two last hearts, and I will probably gamble one of them away, and... Yeah, that leaves us with half health on the next floor. That would be just fine for me. Just fine. For me. And we even have 15 cents, so... Uh, the shop should be completely, totally viable. And here we go. Now, what's me as I... <laughs> Ah, I would have half health and probably end up with a necropolis floor or something like that. That would be stupid. I would hate that. <laughs> hmm. I'm still not so sure about our choices. I don't think we'll win, but this will be an interesting run nonetheless. And that's the last play. Didn't do anything. Just gonna leave. I could go complete... Actually... I could go a bit harder on it. Because this uh, heart up here will probably end up paying for itself. We'll do that. Uh, yeah, that will probably end up paying for itself. Which means that we will still have 15 cents and we get two more chances to get a blood bank. Which means that we do not get 15 cents. In such case, uh, we're likely to find one cent at the next floor. Got a, got a blood up. Great. Which is also. Um... Nah, that's not. Nah, that's not worth it. Also, a speed upgrade, both really lovely. Almost took you, not gonna do that. He's more likely to screw me over than he is to pay out with something good in the end. Especially if I get something like the relic. Relic. Relic? I don't think these guys can even get up here. Nope, and they actually die from a. Uh... Oh dear. This is uh, a terrible room. <laughs> Absolutely terrible. Okay, we seriously need to get some more damage, so we will be really... Oh, Curse of Darkness again, really? Oh, this game just loves me, huh? Okay. Almost got hit there, don't want to get hit. Be careful of the fire. Come on. Uh, uh, uh. Careful. Okay. Oh, I forgot that there's a turret there. How did that not shoot onto now? That surprises me a lot. Wow, that's a lot of bombs, though. So that making, that's making up for the fact that we are uh, having trouble with this floor. Ooh, this is bad. I'm tempted to just do this rather than be uh, all that. Ah, that's too good to use. That's some good dodging, if I may say so myself. Uh, with the Book of Belial, our damage actually becomes somewhat decent. Although, still not good. So that actually gave us a bomb to do this. Hopefully that gives us something. Yeah, one coin. I, I told you we were going, getting at least one coin in this floor. Okay, let's wait with the two in the center. I think I don't need to free them. Which would be perfect, because that means that uh just do this. Yup. Actually, maybe I can slingshot that in there, yeah. <laughs> a fly should not be a problem at all. Oh yeah, that's how you sling slingshot that thing. I think the bigger it gets, the more damage it does. This should be a good room for uh, our technology to do some wonders. Unfortunately, still weak, which is a problem to some extent, but hey, it's actually decently good. Decently good. It's working decently. So here is our shop, and that turns out to be a great fight. Book of the Last should help this fight, though. Even though it should not be that difficult already, but uh, just to avoid taking too much damage. Got a bit, uh, a bit more money, and another key for some reason as well. That's good, good. Hmm, Roid Rage? Yeah, sure, that's speed and rage upgrade. Range upgrade. Our range really doesn't need uh, to be upgraded because we have infinite range, but uh, speed upgrade is still good, especially for dodging purposes. I seem to be a bit, have a bit of a hard time aiming now, though, which is uh, not to my advantage. Oh, wow, we are so weak. This was probably not the best idea I've gotten in a while. Oh, well, easy enemies. There we go. Come on. Okay, we're doing better than I expected, considering uh, taking into account how, uh, well, despite how weak we are. Okay. Dealt with a room of these guys a moment ago. That turned out fairly good. I'm expecting this room to be no different. 
Just don't be too cocky and you should be able to do this perfectly fine. So the game really wants to pay out with, with keys this time around. Which I guess I can't complain about, but it's just... Odd. Okay, this room I do not like, for obvious reasons. For the same obvious reasons as always. Um, just the fact that we are damaging that bomb fly so slowly is uh, really unnerving. Okay, please just die. Someone. This room is really not... It's a bit too crowded. I knew it. It was doomed to happen eventually. Just thanks to the sheer overcrowding of this room. Okay, so we shouldn't have to worry about these guys. Nope, not a problem. Um, I think it's more likely for a secret room to be over here. Eh, maybe my internal map is incorrect on that. That's another bomb's key. I don't think we really want to do that, though. I think we are fairly... Ooh, that is very, very interesting. But we're going to fight the boss first. Loki, I died to you recently, didn't I? No, didn't I? Ah, <laughs> well, that hurts. So that takes away the deal with the devil chances. Very unfortunate, but... Uh, oh, well, it happened. Can't be helped. If that spike block would just not be so damn annoying... And... Oh, if the bird would just stop hunt, hunting that. Ah, much better. Thank you. You're actually figuring out who the real enemy here is. Thank you, bird. And thank you for that. So the box, that's actually a decent item. Kane's eye, I have no idea what does. The lovers, that's good. And the bombs a key again. Well, I guess we could pop that and pop the other one afterwards. Lovers, that's two hearts. So I think... I might just, uh, I might not need that, okay. So, Lava's card, I'll just leave that here. Nah, uh, actually, we might need it if I find, find an arcade or something on this floor. And then I wouldn't want to have to backtrack. Ah, <laughs> uh, we don't even need, need to take that. We have pretty much equal amounts of bumps and keys by now. <laughs> so we've been here. We've not been here. Oh, we have been here. We've not been here. Okay. If these guys just die, well, that's uh, how we have to play it. They have to die. Ouch! I need to uh, react a bit faster. I actually saw him coming. Uh -uh. Just didn't move, which is uh, unfortunate, <laughs> to say the least. I feel like I'm saying a lot of the same things over and Oh, I really want that heart. It's not worth sacrificing anything for that spirit heart, though. Okay. This room sucks. Let's just uh, agree on that. Because uh, I, I might not get cornered. I might get cornered. Okay, the, the copies... Oh, I forgot that that is also creep stuff. Copies hairball really helped me there, though. That's good. This room should be... Uh, Fairly simple if I just uh, don't get hit by those guys. I don't think I need to use the Book of Bilal here. Uh, it would be a good damage up. Great though, just to get it over with. Now that the bird is out though, I don't think I need it. That's probably not the best use of Book of Bilal, but hey. If I don't use it, I shouldn't really have it at all, should I? Uh, so our uh, orbital either... Okay, let's see if we can do some damage with our hairball. There we do. Go. Either way, we deal damage with something if we do this. <clears throat> I can't hit it. Well, we got it eventually. Uh, Abel, well, we haven't seen you in a while, so I might as well pick you up. Hello and welcome back to the battle. You seem to be sort of... Well, you seem to come around quite often. Previously, actually, I might be able to. Might as well check if there's a second secret room. Uh, well, we got the coin. If that helps anything. Uh, well, we might as well go in here. Check that. Two pills. We don't know what it is. Tell pills. That's me to the secret room. Is that the second secret room? So, rusted key actually doesn't work. I've read up on that. Turns out that's the case. Now I want to go back into that, that cursed room to get the other pill and uh, 
And my card back. Tears up. Yeah, I guess that's not too bad. It helps. It helps. Might as well take use of the invincibility we had there for a moment. And now to try and remember where we were going to get back to uh, the boss room. Ah, that might actually be it. Is this the way? I think this is the way. Yep, that seems about right. Bumps a key right there. Which, uh, truth be told, I'm going to pop that one. And we're going to grab the uh, world card and head down to the next floor. Which is the mom battle floor, so now things are starting to get interesting. Abel should be helping me out a bit here with some extra damage. Yeah, that's actually pretty good crowd control right there. This room could be interesting. Not so much though. Uh, hello, Sloth. Okay, so this is a Booger Belial room, obviously. Mini boss and all that jazz. And, uh. Yeah, that's actually a really easy boss battle. So, what do you give us? Another pill and the full card. Rains down. Okay, that shouldn't hurt us at all. The full card, though, is interesting because if I can manage to get a deal with the devil at this floor, if I can up my chances of a deal with the devil at this floor, so not very likely, but could happen. Then um, this will make it possible to enter it at all. Thanks to the mom fight locking all the doors. We can actually omit those doors simply by glitching the game a tiny bit. And there goes half of our chance. Of no, actually we have, uh, we have spirit hearts for a change. So that actually helps us. It's a bit of a cushion. Take some of the blow. That's interesting. That's not good though. Okay, let's hope we don't lose all our spirit hearts on stupid rooms like that. Okay, rule number one in rooms like these, be careful. I don't know how I've only managed to take one hit this far. I don't like the fact that there are two turrets in this room. If that had just been only a single one, that would have done a whole deal a lot easier. Okay. Okay. I think we can make it out of here without taking any more damage. Which would be excellent because then we have not we have still not taken any red hard damage at this point. Now we just need to find Um Actually to try and ensure our chances a bit better, I am going I'm willing to do this. Isaac's fork. Yeah. Not a great trinket. I don't even know what Isaac King's eye does. I should probably look that up while I'm doing this anyway. Justice is good. Justice is really good. Really good, actually. It's one of each. I was hoping for uh, for it to pay out with a soul heart, obviously. Spirit heart, sorry. Didn't happen. Well, I should probably use my smartphone to try and look up uh, Kane's eye while we're doing this. Since this is pretty automatic stuff anyway. Kane's eye. Drink it, drink it, drink it. What do we get? Ah, soul heart. Perfect. What was that? Samson's lock. Drink it. Ah, Kane's eye. Found it, found it, found it. When starting a floor, 25% chance to get the compass effect for a duration of the floor. Ah, that's really not that great. Hmm, Samson's lock is uh, perhaps better. This card could be good. That's another world card. Oh, actually, yeah, another world card. This is starting to get a bit crammed here. <laughs> I've used more money here than I actually want to, so I'm just going to blow it up. And uh, yeah, that gave me money back, so that's good. What do we want, though, of Trinket? Um, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Samson's Log, I guess that is the best Trinket we can get here. Everything considered. So since we can actually get out of the mom fight battle again, thanks to the full card, I will go straight for the boss right away to uh, try and improve our chances of the deal with the devil. Obviously. Full card will send us back to the start of this floor. The start room of this floor. Uh, this is bad. This is really bad. I need to focus on actually having an overview of this floor. Or this room. Which is not something I am... Uh, uh, actually, this helps. Let's just not... There. Trigger any of the bomb flies at uh, 
bad times, it would be totally fine. Absolutely fine, actually. Okay, so that was a well-managed room. Just one more. And then not take damage at the mom fight, obviously. Which is uh, not likely to happen. <laughs> okay, so this is a really annoying room layout for this. Yeah, I expected that. I didn't expect it to take two hits, though. Was that our soul heart? That was our soul heart. Hmm. Please, so... No, that's a lot of money, though. We will totally go to the boss room. So we had a mini-boss. There's no boss in... in uh, no mini-boss... No greed in the boss room. Okay, so this is interesting. I need to actually do this properly for a change. Try not to take too much of any damage. That would be really nice. I don't usually succeed too well on that when it comes to the mom battles for some reason. For some reason that didn't hit at all. Okay. Careful. Ah, come on. Mom's fat. Uh, no, don't, don't, don't. Don't do, don't let her trindle you down like that. There we go, take that out. Get out of the way of eventual mom's fat arm. Ah, come on. Okay, this is probably one of the worst mom battles I've had in a while. I don't know why, for some reason, mom, mom battles just seem to have gotten harder on there lately. Maybe because I'm off, like, I've gotten a pretty weak when I get to them recently. Ah, that's a foot. Most bad leg and die. Okay, so here's the Polaroid. Guess there was no reason to do all the trinket thinking. An HP upgrade and a full card. Okay, we might have a deal with the devil up there. Probably, most likely, certainly not. Let's do that. Didn't kill anyone, but ouch. I will save that uh, soul heart for. Uh, when we go down to the next floor, because it doesn't seem worthy of, uh, worth it to pick it up now. I'm glad we have someone's range, because that means that I can just go across the room like this and still hit the idiots. Yeah, that item could potentially screw us over by destroying our half heart interval, which uh, we actually have right now, surprisingly enough. I didn't even notice that until I started speaking about it. It's good, it's good. Tears up. Yeah, we're starting to get a decent amount of. Uh, ooh, that's good. So we get the compass and a soul heart. And, well, not a card, but hey. I know we have a curse room on this floor, but I don't really feel like going to it. Do we have anywhere where the secondary secret room could be rather obvious? I can think of. Too many locations, unfortunately. So we will skip out on that. We will skip out on that. I am actually willing to do this. Just because our health is kind of meh. Unfortunately. Did I even go to the secret room? I don't think I did. What am I even doing with my life? Yeah, that's right. We got the, the world card, which showed it, but I never went to it. Here we go. Bob's rotten head. Horrible item. Worth my time? Not. <laughs> Not worth my time. So I guess we will be... Well, cross your fingers for a deal with the devil. It will not happen, but well, you, you never know. Nope. Going down. Please, please, please. That's the womb one. It's not too tough, I think. Isn't Yusuro the tougher one of the two? I think? I might be wrong. I might be wrong and just tricking myself into thinking that we get the easy one just to comfort myself a bit. It could happen. I don't like the fact that we have to deal with a uh, champion of this uh, of this guy. Especially when I feel like I'm in a tight spot here. We did get some money from it though. Which is utterly useless unless we meet uh, a beggar again. Thanks to the fact that there are no more shop so much, so much money. Please let this be the right way. Okay, so there could be a Tinder Rock here, so obviously I will do this. No Tinder Rock, but... Um, that's a trinket, right? Isaac's head. Yeah, I'm sorry Isaac's head, but... I need the Polaroid. For several reasons. 
There's the boss room, so we did go to the... What am I even doing with my life? I don't like the fact that we have not gotten a single damage upgrade for this run, and we're playing as Eve. It's um, quite horrible, quite terrible, it's really bad. <laughs> okay, that could help us get more pills, but our pill rotation isn't too great, so oh jeez, man. You're gonna do this to me? So Conquest, you all know how that fight goes down. Not too well. Okay, don't hit me. And ouch, that totally hit me. This is uh, a really horrible boss battle. There is no denying that. I don't think you it's I don't think many people have managed to get out of this boss battle without taking any damage. Thankfully, Dead Bird will help us. Slightly. Ah, uh, okay. Ever so slightly. Okay, so we're halfway through. Ouch. There's no way you can dodge these, those things. It's so random. It's all numbers. All random numbers. Okay, that was fine. Which I really don't like for a boss fight. When it's just random numbers, that really... If it comes down to random numbers, that's just unfair. In this case, because then it takes no skills to... You can't even... If, even if you have skills, there's no avoiding it. Now he's just doing that, so well, I guess we're fine on the random part, as long as he keeps doing this. Best part about this, technology actually doesn't have any knockback, so uh, that's not a worry. It doesn't go through rocks though, I could really use some piercing, oh, well, what is that all called? Push pin shots. Uh, I don't like this fight at all, but it seems to be making it out here, here. yep. Of course we get the white pony, which is um, it's the ability to fly, which is tempting. But we're going down without it. Okay, so I did see that there's a secret room here. If you didn't notice, um, you might want to skip back a bit in the video and uh, take a quick look because you can actually see it, it uh, disappearing right at the start of the floor. So, that paid out with a pill? Lockdown pill. Well, we already got one, so why not? Bob's a key not worth taking from me right now. We will be going for the arcade. Might seem like a stupid idea, but I kinda like the idea of having a chance of getting some more health. That was handled well, thanks to our speed. This room, I do not like. Especially because of the champion version of... Uh, oh, actually, I thought the other dude was champion. I like the fact that we can shoot him from so far away though. So this is champion, but I don't feel that at all because it's locked in a pattern. So, no reason to fear what you can predict. Only fear the unknown. <laughs> okay, so that's some more money, some more health. I think this is the crate, wait, yep. No, wait. Ow, 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 ouch. What am I, what am I even doing with my... Okay. Let's do that first and foremost. Seems like a smart move. And get rid of that. That's three champions in one room? That's insane. That's so unlikely. So unusual. Okay. Push pin. I was speaking of that a bit earlier. Fortunately, we don't really have Mom's purse, so... Ah, that, this was the right way. Could that be a pill worth my time? Speed down. Uh... No, not really. I kind of feel confident with my speed. This could be good for Spirit Heart generation. Or oh, it could just do that. That is definitely a better space bar item though. Hank Man. Okay, so that's the ability to fly. For a short while. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I think it's a clever move to go with... Uh, Uh, I don't actually know. I think it's the better move to go with the crystal ball. But I kind of do like the Book of Bilal because it can help us get damage. But of course, if if the crystal ball pays out with... Um, what is that called again? Mm, sun card, devil card, any card that does the same or 
something equally good. This should actually be decently handled. And it also gives us the, the uh, ability to seal the floor, as should be obvious. Same effect as the world card. Okay, so we, we don't really need our money for anything but this, this so uh, we might as well. Ah, that actually paid out of the heart. That was worth it. Thankfully we have... Um... Ah, yeah, I ruined my, my uh, half-heart interval. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> okay, more keys. If we manage to make it to the chest, which we might... Uh, actually, looking at our health, that mm, seems a bit uh, like wishful thinking by now. Hmm. I should not have blown up that um, that arcade machine. That more thing is safe for sure, because that could also have given us some more hearts, if I just hadn't been so impatient with it. De definitely getting some more bombs, though. We're getting all the consumables we don't want, or don't need. And since I said that, of course, now flies come. Pretty please? Yes. Oh, even a spirit heart. Wonderful. So if I just heal up a bit here, please, ah, uh, random chance, huh? Hmm, if I can heal up a bit, we should definitely be able to make it through the mom's heart fight. That is hardly a challenge. And now watch me as I die in it, but still, it should really not be a challenge at this point. Did I not buy the compass? I think, no, I probably did. Yeah, I did. I did buy the compass, didn't I? Yeah, I did because I know that. Hmm, that's interesting. So that really, this really is the only special room in this floor. Huh? Such emptiness. Much confusion. <laughs> so this could be a bit because he keeps paying out with uh, stuff. I don't think he can pay out with an item anymore, though. So he should be hanging around forever. Unless he could pay. If he could pay out with a shop item, that would be wonderful. I'm just going off on a whim here and say, like, mom, mom's habit, nun's habit, would be absolutely perfect. Gobby's hairball's really becoming huge and disgusting. <laughs> so we got the, the, um, the golden key, the skeleton, not the skeleton key, the golden key. Which means that all the keys of this floor will, uh, well, we won't need any keys for this floor. So, just a few more plays and we'll be done here. Unless he pays out with money, of course. Yeah, that was about to happen, of course. <laughs> so, we've been through this song and dance before, haven't we? Seems awfully familiar at the very least. Time's just ticking by, don't worry. You like long episodes, don't you? <laughs> at least uh, you won't be able to tell that uh, I'm probably going to fail. <laughs> just by looking at the time. So we've gotten a lot of chances of getting some health here, but he's not willing to pay out. I'm just playing with the hairball, don't mind me. And there's some more gambling potential. And some more gambling potential, because this guy just loves us too much to let go. But not enough to actually give us something we need. Nope, definitely not enough to actually give us something we need. Now he's probably going to pay out with the bombs. Huh? No? More money, yeah, sure, sure. Yep, I uh, kind of saw that coming. This guy has us locked in a death grip. A match that will never end simply because he... He likes our company too much. But not enough to actually help us. In the manner that we actually want. So, come on. Ah, thankfully. That's how half heart into us, well. Now we might actually be tempted to gamble a bit more. It seems stupid because now we're staying a bit longer. We hairball flying. Don't have to worry about the flies. That is something I am so happy about. Because we meet them a lot here. Oh, didn't I? Yeah, there we go. Key time. Nope, no more keys for us. And last. Unless I start gambling hearts again, then... Uh, Nothing more to us here. For us here. So I might be tempted to... It's probably a bad, bad idea, but I am tempted to actually go and explore some more of the... I didn't notice there was a fly right there. So more lockdown, sure. Since we're already going down, we might as well go in further. So we lost our... Um... 
We lost our spirit heart already, that was fast. Uh, I don't like these guys. Now we have to actually get comfortable with this lag of... Uh, damage dealing. Simply because it gave up the Book of Bilal. Ooh, this is a... Six room charge? Item? It might be. I don't like the idea of having a item, space by item that takes that long to recharge. Yep, this is a six room charge item. Yay! Huh. Well, if with some log, it might pay out with some really good stuff, which would make it worth it. This is bad. Double gluttony. Well, like, it could have a decent payout, though. In the form of soul hearts, hopefully. Or just normal hearts. It's actually also fine with me. So now they're no longer in sync, which is when it becomes a bit more dangerous. So, I took damage there, unfortunately. Other than that, we're actually dealing fairly well with this. Never mind. So I paid back one heart. I lost two. Whoa! Guess Gobby's hairball did that. So let's be a bit careful about that. Okay. Might as well take uh, usage of the uh, Mr. Mega glitch just to. Uh... Oh, is there... I could have sworn this looks like the perfect placement for. Uh... Ah, there. Yeah, that's not going to be the secondary secret room. That's too far to too close to the edge of the map. So I'm. Yeah, so many places it could be. Well, we have to go this way to uh, get to the boss fight. Oh dear. Don't want that. Do not want, would not recommend. Die. Yep, that blew him up. Perfect. I must admit, I have no idea how well much uh, or little Gobby's hairball has helped us, simply because I haven't kept track of it. But I'm hoping that it has helped a good deal. Simply because it seems like one of those items that uh, you don't really notice it helps, but it helps. Okay. More health, that's good, we need that. This is exactly why I love the Golden Ghee. Yes, it does cost us a bomb, but at least we get a bomb back and two coins that we could go back and gamble for. Hey, hey. Okay, four Larry Juniors. I don't expect this to be a problem. I didn't expect it to be a problem, but my bad dodging or judgment, depending on how you look at it, managed to uh, do that. Speed down. Yeah, I don't know. As a spirit heart, that's actually really, really freaking useful. Uh, I don't even know why I went in here. To lose my spirit heart, I guess. It's the sole reason I went in here. Oh, dear goodness. My play is so bad today. But not in the same manner that it was yesterday, where we was just plain awful. Uh, yesterday, as in the last two episodes. Prior to this. Today is just... Uh, I thought I could dodge that. Does it really move so fast that you can't dodge it today? Ow, oh, ow. Oh. Okay. So now our damage is good though. I really wish we could get Gobby's paw. If we could get that, we would be so sad because that helps our damage a lot. So needless to say, we're going back to gamble with the gambler bit just to get some help because in our current state, I could actually see us losing to Mom's heart, which is really, really sad because that, ba that boss battle you should really not be able to lose. Did I not get Polaroid Invincibility? That is... odd. So, please pay out now? Now that I really need it? I will blow you up in the end if you don't manage to help me out. Which you don't really seem to want. Ugh, keys. I don't need the keys anymore. I don't need the keys, dude! Health. Help me with some health. Is that really too much to ask for? Apparently so. We have one orbital that is really not helping us out a lot. What I can tell at least this far. I haven't noticed us getting any uses of it at least. Uh, don't pay out with money. Pay out with health. That's not health. Come on, you, you've got to admit this has got to be some of the worst luck I've had in a while in the, in the arcade. I really should not have blown up that uh, slot machine, huh? The chances of getting health on that were pr probably better, and if nothing else, it seems like it was paying out, or the other one at least, was paying out with a lot of bomb, not bombs, pills, and that could be 
potentially more keys. Uh, full health pill in our rotation. Uh, to be honest, I think we would have seen that by now. Oh, jeez, man. Uh, so I have lots of luck when it comes to money. Just not when it comes to health. Do we really have to go into the mom's half heart? What? Heart? <laughs> Fight with half a heart? If that becomes a thing, I will blow up this... Uh, Blood donation machine. Oh, come on, dude. Come on, game. I don't want to die to Mom's Heart. How can we only be at Mom's Heart and having already played an hour? That by itself is actually pretty embarrassing. I didn't even know it's until now. That's one heart. Okay, so, um. We can get hit one one time during the mom's uh, mom's heart battle. If I seem a bit lost in words, it's because I am actually quite surprised that it took so long to get here. <laughs> um, has my play really degraded that much? No, I don't think so. It must just be because of uh, it being even just. I think it's the fact that we haven't gotten a single uh, damage upgrade. That really doesn't help our situation. Whoa! Did I just get pushed off the map? <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong, but I I just got pushed off the map, didn't I? Okay, so we have a bit of invincibility that we can't use, but at least we do some decent... I wouldn't call it decent, actually. We do some better damage. Not decent damage. Actually, I will pop this just because when mom starts dealing with her creep, if we get that far, I would be, I would love to be able to just fly over it. That is really really dangerous. Okay, so I have no bomb, I have no crop control using bombs. Can't get hit a single time. It's really terrible. No. Okay. I'm, I'm really scared of how uh, how this is going. I'm not scared. I'm a uh, Okay, that worked. No, that is... I don't want to die to myself. That would be really an awful way to go. Gummy Terrible is really horrible when it comes to bombs. Like, really, really awful. Okay, we're almost in mom's permanent state and we managed to get Chop out here. Don't die to Chop. Okay, that should probably have hurt me. Gubby's hairball is really glitching me out. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I didn't even see that we were in the permanent state. That's not fair. Ugh, sorry if, uh, Okay, I hope you enjoyed this run even though that was really long considering how little progress we made, but it was interesting. We got some it's, we got some unusual combinations of items that were really not worth my time, but well, anyway, this has already been long enough. Thank you for watching. Hope you will see Karen the next time. Bye for now.